talking about. Just what I came after. Oh, you nut. Like seven pounds? Oh, yeah, we got some back and forth. Oh my god! Oh shit! Ah! Ah! Got it! Holy crap! First cast on the swim bait down here under the bridge. Nice large mouth. Oh yeah. Very first cast. Didn't even have the camera on yet. Good sign. Wow. These swim baits are, I got to order more. I got three left, and that is it. They are called missile. Chartreuse and white missile swim baits. Very good luck with these things so far. I mean, tons of fish on them. Very productive. And they got some better colors than this. They got one I've been checking out called Brass Monkey that I just know is going to work. Nice large mouth. Eleven Point River. About one mile from the Arkansas state line. Nice. All right, let's get her back in. <clears throat> Look, Lily. Look. Look at that. Look, Lily. Look. something big guys real big whoa I have no idea what this could be honestly it was on a red wiggler and it is putting up one hell of a fight I don't have a clue red wiggler first cast in this swift current it's acting like a sucker fish it could be a walleye too I guess I honestly have no freaking clue but it's nice whatever this is it's three or four pounds it feels like it's a big large mouth on a red wiggler and split shot in three feet of water, guys. Biggest bass I've caught out of this river for sure. Oh my God, no, it's a dang drum. Boy, it had me fooled. I swore I seen green. Well, it's a nice drum nonetheless. At least they are biting. I can tell right now this full moon has got the fish really active, guys. Wow, they are really active without a doubt. I, I knew something was wrong there. My goodness. He's about four pounds though. My gosh. What a big old drum. Oh boy. Yeah, what is this, Lily? What is that? Is that a fish? Is that a fishy? Guys. What one hell of a fight in that swift current. Wow. Today's a good fishing day. Just like any other full moon and all the conditions are right. Pre-front conditions. Low 80s, no humidity. Light breeze. Wow. 
What a hoss. Thank you for giving me a fight there, buddy. Oh my goodness. I was wondering what the heck that could be. Uh, I swore I seen the color green. It was just a figment of my imagination, apparently. Oh yeah, oh cool, wow, I have not caught one of these in years that looks like this guys, wow, the stone roller with the red, got the red dot, that is cool, what a beauty. A male where they get the little tiny red dot right there on their head that is so cool something different guys central stone roller got the bumps all over his head got the uh, little red dot like a red ear would but a little bit closer to their eye he's about five or six he's about seven inches long it's a nice little guy that's really cool. What a beauty. Wow. Definitely something different and unique. All right, guys, I got to go over. I'm going over to get another split shot in my worms. I'm going to have to set my worms on that thing. And then I got to climb up here to be able to fish. It's really my best bet, though. I can get up here with after I'm here a few minutes, they will unspook. And it's the best way I can think of to get fish. After getting him, that's really cool, man. I've caught three fish and they've all been different kinds. Got one. Oh, that was a nice one. Don't know what that was. I think it was a red ear. Got another one. Oh, I'm, this is a good spot, guys. Look at this bluegill. My goodness. This is a hell of a spot. This tree is laying across this bridge pillar. I swam out here, jumped on it, and just fishing off of it. It takes a lot of dedication. That is a nice bluegill for a spring-fed cold river like this. Wow. Sweet. All right, I got four different kinds now. What a beauty. All right. Whoa. All right. Oh, yeah. There we go. All right, on the swim bait, guys. Little bass, but hey. They are pretty active today so far. Oh, fell off. I'm on the missile swim bait. There was another one. Had another bite right after that one.
on a red wiggler, guys. I seen little, I meant little. Nice sunfish. Oh yeah. So long here. What a beauty. Gorgeous. Alright folks, I got another bass on the swim bait. Again. The missile. And he's tried to get me hung up about three times. Not too bad, about a pound. See if I can get another one. A big one. So I just hooked into a big largemouth vertical jigging. I am standing out on a tree in the middle of the river. And I was just literally moving this lure up and down. A pink swim bait. Oh, yeah. As you can see behind me, I've walked. It goes almost completely across the river, and it's real sturdy. Wow. Nice bass. Another real large mouth. No spots today. Not a one. All right. Not bad. Not bad at all. Woo. Definitely scared them for a while though. I guarantee there's some flatheads hiding in this hole as well. Got him on the pink pulsar. It's a nice large mouth. He's actually two pounds. Wow. Just moving the lure straight up and down, guys, because you can't cast here. It's too too woody. So I'm just finding the little spaces in between and vertical jigging. Got to change your tactics to adapt. Adapt and overcome. I'm going to get this guy back in. Not bad. Not a bad bass. Best fish of the day so far. That destroyed my lure though. I might get one more use out of it, boy. That will take long when they... Gosh. Mm. He literally destroyed it. I can get one more bite on it. He messed it up that bad. That's sad. 